Hey, what's going on everyone out there? My name is Jake James Lugo. Welcome to the channel and welcome to this brand new JJ's First 20. So we're taking a look at Battle Shapers. I was sent this recently uh, by the developers to check out for you guys. Here, let me lower this a little bit just so you guys could hear me. Okay, But yeah, uh, I got a chance to check out this game. It's on uh, Steam Early Access right now. It's kind of like a mixture of like Mega Man meets FPS meets other types of like genres and stuff. So I'll show you guys right now. It's got a couple roguelike elements where you're meant to like replay it over and over again. You'll see it totally exactly what I'm talking about once we get into it. But as I'm playing this, let me know what's up in the comments. If you guys dig this game, if you've heard of it, if you guys want to check it out, leave a like on this video. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Show some love. But yeah, here we go. We're just starting out here. You're playing as this character where you gain like a bunch of different abilities as you take out various like robot masters or robot bosses in these different locations and you could customize uh, a lot of different things, you know, different types of like, you know, bonuses and boosts that you get stuff. Let me actually give myself this a reloader. There's no other abilities, right? There's uh, uh, nothing else I could get. But basically these gems you get is from the different runs that you have as you kill enemies and, and do different stuff. So let's go. Wait, hold on. Let me just interact with this robot. Check it out. His name is uh, Mimo. Okay, and the character we're playing as is Ada. It's pretty dope. Pretty cool. Can you Whoops. No, I didn't want to. I didn't want to actually hit him. So one of the things that I do notice is that you do get a variety of different weapons that you could pick up on your runs. A lot of different things that which you could do. Let me lower this a little bit. Just a tiny bit there. So you get also these different cores that give you various abilities, different enhancements. A lot of stuff you could do, which is cool. So hold on, we got here, outburst, reflective punches, dash. Uh, what's this one again? Outburst, explosive attack, flex incoming projectiles. Yeah, okay. So yeah, just to hold on to those for the time being. Let's go now over to the exact section to begin our runs. Start taking out enemies. There we go. Whoops. So as you take out enemies, you can punch them back. And actually, whoops. See, it just do that there. Got him. There's another one over here. Got him. Okay, cool. And then there goes a chest that you can open up. Nice. We'll take that. Ooh, got a new weapon. So hold on. We got a new weapon, son. So yeah, that's pretty much how the flow of the game goes. You go to different areas, you take out various enemies. Hold on, what's this over here? Get all this like extra currency and stuff. But um, yeah, that's the flow of the game. And you'll see the Mega Man thing I was talking about in a minute. Once I get over to like the, lo the world select or location select. You'll see what I mean in a second. Oh, we got more enemies. Where are they? Gonna go over here. Got him. Okay, where's the other guy? There he is. Oh, I got exploded. Okay, there's one more. There he is. Got him here. Oh, God. Cool. Did a burn damage to him. Took him out like that. Let's open up this chest. So, those chests, they give you various different abilities, various different currency. Like, this little chip over here I'm going to is going to give me, uh, what is it, an ability here. Yeah, the pulse grenade. Changes up, like, my grenade properties. Allows me to do damage in various different ways, which is cool. So, we're almost there. Oh, what's this? No, oh, this is the arm core enhancement. There we go. Got that core enhancement. Nice. So we have a couple different things. We got a crippling dash. We could go maximum shields. All shield pickups will recharge your outburst. Uh, after combat, your shield, you regenerate the first 10% of your shields. No, let's go the crippling dash. That way we deal more damage to different enemies and stuff. Whoops, I did the wrong uh, button there. If I go around, that's kind of like that little icon to dash, you know, through some like this platforming sections. There we go, see? I already got this. I think that's everything else here, right? Oh, yeah. Now, there's certain sections in this game where it's like you can't get past unless you have certain abilities. 
And I don't think I have the ability to get around that right now at the moment. Lore discovered. Lore is just basically story stuff that's like part of the little data things inside the menus. But no, we want to go to this over here. This is where we want to go at. So now, this is where it gets to that Mega Man thing I was talking about. It basically shows you like this location, this world map, quote unquote. Select your target. Now in the demo here for this early access version, we only have Vault Colossus, which is like the one boss or robot master we could go to. But there's other ones here as well that'll be in the full version of the game. Uh, you could press A to select the previous one if you've gone into one and just haven't completed all of it and you were just in it. But we're gonna go to Vault Colossus. Check it out. It's exactly like Mega Man or Mega Man X with the way that it does like its little introduction after the stage select. So that's pretty cool to me. I think that's pretty dope. Just like checking my uh, microphone there. Anyway, you guys will see exactly what I'm talking about when I go into it now where you go through the stage, you do a bunch of stuff, you fight enemies and you go all the way up to the robot master. And it's much like a roguelike where even if you die, you go back to where you were or where we were before in the hub section. And you could attempt to do it again and again with different abilities and other stuff that you unlock. The idea is to repeat that so that way you can get strong enough to get over some of these hurdles. So here we go. There's Ada. There she is. She's like, yeah, we're ready to punch somebody. Somebody's getting smacked up. Now here we go. So if you ever wanted to see like a first person version of Mega Man work, this will definitely be kind of like that. So we got these different floor hacks. Uh, floors in the next room will be rewarded health. Uh, deploys jump bags and forces the next room to rewards to be a core enhancer. Hmm. No, let's be a core enhancer. That way we do that. Get a little core hack. Back already. Oh, he's talking smack. He's talking smack right now. Hey, where? That's a mine. Hold on, he's got being shielded. Okay, hold on. There's somebody. Where's this other thing that's like powering them? Oh, I see. It's up. He's up there. There he is. I try to get this fool. He's up there. No, that's not what I wanted. That's what I wanted. Hit the wrong button. Whoops. Got him. Okay, there we go. Switch weapons just so I can be a little bit fast. There he is. Come here. Nope. I'm trying to get her right now. Got him. Okay. Now we're back in business. We were getting attacked pretty heavy. There we go. Got him. Got him. Okay, cool. Is that everybody? Yeah, that's everybody. Yeah, that was everybody. Nice. It's got a little bit hairy there. Shut it. Hold on. Interesting. Nope, that's not what I wanted. Keep hitting the wrong button there. Let me get these different these different boxes and stuff. There's one also up top that's marked before we go into the next room. Grab that right there. There's a couple. Hold on, let's grab this one. Get a little bit of currency. A little bit of currency. Get a core enhancement. So what's this core enhancement? So we got your punch deals increased damage when your shields are over 75. Upon taking lethal damage, you become briefly invulnerable and your shields are replenished. This can trigger only one per run. Uh, you have a chance to also gaining overdrive when you gain haste. Now let's do the Phoenix Protocol. That's always a good thing. Helps us out there. More currency. Look at this. Look at that little... Okay, so what's this? Uh, to pay 180 credits. What do we get here? 
Echo waves. Projectile projects multiple waves of energy that inflicts viral. Okay. Okay, yeah, let's do that. Okay, it's a little bit different than our grenade. So we got a couple things. This that doesn't go anywhere. Okay. A different door, so I guess this is the door we have to go to. Yeah, is this the right door? I think so. For another beating, okay. Alright, come at me, bro. Let's do this. Oh no, this is the wrong way. Again, some of the rooms look similar, so no, we went the wrong way. Let's go. Let's go this way. Uh, up here. This is the door right here. Oh no, we missed it before. There we go. Alright, let's go, son. Let's go, son. Look around. Okay, so now a little platforming action. So now we have to be careful. Grab this right here. Thank you. We'll take that. Now there we go. And I don't think there's anything else up here, right? Yeah, no, I think we're good, right? Yeah, we're good. So let's uh, go into the next room. Here we go. It's combat time. I have to reload there. Oh, damn it. They're all being protected. You know, some of those enemies are being protected. You see? It's the thing in the back. Try to get that there. Trying to hit it in the back there. I see it. There it is. Come here. Shit, I'm getting low health. Did I get it? Got it. Finally. There we go. Okay, so now let's do some major damage. Ooh, retaliation. Okay. He's going to do stuff. Vault mines. Those are mines. Whoops. Oh, let me go through this way. Go around. Yeah, I'm trying to uh, navigate through these mines that are like all around. Where are these enemies at? There they are. There he is. Come on, reload. There we go. Finally. So we got our shield up. We're good. I think we're good. Okay, nice. And there's a gun. So, what do we got here? What gun is this? What gun is this? Crimson Repeater. Uh, it's 7 out of 7 damage. We got 7 out of 51. So, you know, let's all replace this one with the one that we have. Because we have a better version of it now. It does a little bit more damage. Now, we need health. Let me see if we can find a box. There we go. That doesn't give us health, but it gives us shield, I think. Just double-checking around. See what we find here. Anything else around here? Nope, 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 nope. Before we go through the door. Keep getting, like, different... Uh, Actually, no, that's my ability that keeps going up. It keeps recharging every time I use it. Oh, there goes a box there. Uh, anything else up here? What's up here? Another thing here? Nothing, nothing. We're at one health, <laughs> which is crazy. All right, so time for some more platforming. Nice. Cool. Not bad. Not hard at all. Alright, here we go. Oh, shit. Keep 
Try to do that there. Try to get away. Ooh, nice one. Okay, we got shields. We're good. Got him. Nice. Got all that right there. Got him. Got him. Okay, there's another one there. Finished him. And I think that's everybody, right? Yeah, we're good. Yeah, our shield helped us out there. I just didn't want to get shot and messed up. Ooh, what's this? Shock rifle. This is an assault rifle. Okay, so let's do that a little bit better than our pistol here. Yeah, let's see how this shoots. Yeah, that's what we're talking about. We like seeing assault rifle stuff in, in a FPS here. Is there any boxes nearby? Just double check around, just in case. Just double checking. See if there's anything that we need besides the gun here. That's the one we just dropped. Nothing else here. Nothing else here. Check out all these like little like technical equipment. So very again, it's very Mega Man esque with just how you could get uh you know the different robot masters, quote unquote, or the enemies and such. Is this the only route? No, there's got to be another route, right? So I came from there. We go up here. Anything? Just double checking, man. Uh, nothing? Nothing? Where am I supposed to go? Or is it above me? No, it's not above me. Because that's the... Maybe I'm supposed to jump. It's the only way? What's this? Hold to return junction. Okay, so I guess, no, we gotta go to a different way. Huh. Whoops. This is down here. Okay, I can't go through there. I guess I need an ability to go through there. I'm trying to look. Okay, that's the one we dropped earlier. This is the previous location that we were at. This is the new lo version? New location? I'm trying to see. Now we're starting to get a little maze-like. No, okay, here we go. Oh. Let me go just grab this fool right here. Oh, damn. Yeah. Okay, hold on. Retaliation. Got him. Okay, is anybody... Whoa. Got him. Okay. Got him. Oh, there's another one there. I didn't even see him. Got him. There we go. Finished him. Alright, so yeah. We went to the right area. It's just... Before, I thought we went to the wrong section. So let me see. There we go to this. I'm running on one health. <laughs> one health. No eight, no uh, recovery items. None of that. Okay, so we got a new core enhancement. What's this new core enhancement that we got? Take down your foes. You gain two fortify. That's new shields. Whenever you gain fury, gain one more stack of it. Critical hits have a chance of giving you overdrive. Odds are better that you have better overdrive than before. Okay, so you know what? We take down foes. You gain two fortify. Let's do that. Because that might actually help us out with the shields. That's our next area. Is there any other boxes? Nothing? I don't see anything down this way. No, 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 no. Okay, let's go this way. Nothing here. Nothing here. Okay, we're going to another room. What's this? Whoa. Whoa. We could go up even further. Okay, not. Okay. We'll just do that. So this is the next room or next section we're going to. There, I'm surprised. Like, there's no, like, power-ups or anything. Like, these got to be used for something. Because remember, in the first room, we had that hacking thing. And I'm guessing in the full game, we'll get more of those to use. 
at some point. Oh, is it? Is this what I think it is? Yes. Oh, no. No. Wait. It might not be. Oh, actually, no. Okay, yeah, we got plot. We got cutscenes. I was going to say, like, we might be going into boss fight time. It might be just about that time for boss fights. Huck and Holly. That's interesting. This guy's got a shop. Look at this. Okay, so now we can buy stuff with our currency. This is a battering ram. Should I do that? Battering ram is times nine. This is fire damage. Because the battering ram is a shotgun. So do we want a pistol with an assault rifle? Or do we want a pistol and assault rifle? Or a pistol and a shotgun? Because that does nine times by nine. So that actually might be pretty good. But then the pistol is actually pretty interesting. Projectiles have 50% to pierce through one foe, and the projectiles have percent to reflect on surfaces up to one time. Hmm. One clip, no charge. I'm trying to see, like, read it. It's like in the corner of the screen. Huh, and then this is a health pack. You know what? Oh, damn, I can't even, I can't even purchase the health pack. What's this? That's the pulse grenade. So, do I want that? You know what? Instead of fire damage, do we want kinetic damage? That actually might be smart because we have this for a longer range. Because this, this is 15. Hmm. You know what? Let's go with the shotgun. Let's go with the shotgun, son. And I can't. I'm surprised I couldn't purchase the the health. That was that was crappy. I should be able to get more health somehow. Oh yes, it's boss fight time. That's exactly what I called it. Now, this is going to be difficult because I'm already, like, depleted by the time I got here. Just annoying. Here we go. As far as you get, Shaper, time to get reacquainted with my fist. It's like, yeah. Do you even have fist? <laughs> shut up. It's a figure of speech. It's like, shut the hell up and let's fight already. Oh, jeez. Immediately destroyed. <laughs> I just got there and immediately I had no health. <laughs> so go figure. So yeah, these are when you get rewards, you get other different things. Uh, you're about at the halfway point it shows you and then there's the other stages and stuff. Of all the stuff that you did in your run. So return to the hideout. But yeah, that's basically, uh, was it, Battle Shapers. <clears throat> that's everything in a nutshell. Okay, for you guys to check out. So hopefully you guys dig this. Again, this is still in early access right now on Steam. You guys can check it out whenever you can. Uh, you should be able to download it now. I believe at the time this video is up. If I'm not, it'll be very soon. But it's pretty cool overall. So those are my thoughts about the game. Let me know your thoughts about it in the comment section down below. Are you going to check this out or not? Leave a like on this video. Subscribe to the channel. And I will talk to all of you again very soon.